Hello, my name is Christian Walter from Trade Wola, and today I would like to talk about some strategy how to protect um, or how to um, hedge your portfolio. I mean, especially stock portfolio. I think there are many different strategies. So if you don't want to miss any of the um, ideas or details, please also subscribe to our channel because in the next weeks we will also um, continue with this topic. I think. Um, it will be an ongoing topic for the next months. Um, but today, mainly, we want to discuss some strategies for a stock portfolio, how to protect these, and um, how to make sure that you cover your losses. <clears throat> of course, one easy strategy is to place stop losses. Um, but I think for someone who is um, in a buy and hold strategy, he normally doesn't want to sell his positions um, just about uh, increasing of in volatility. Um, so there are several other ideas how to do this and um, I want to start with something what might um, give you an example how volatility can uh, save your stock portfolio. We see here for example in March this was um, the index on the volatility we had an up move from yeah, 20 um, approximately to over 80 in the index itself and now after the last three days we are approximately with 40 so there's still um, a long way to go to reach the top of um, a marsh if there's really um, um, yeah, a long down move in the S&P 500 these are products before I forget it it's um, on the S&P 500 but mainly if um, now everything is connected if um, in Germany the index or in uh, anywhere in Europe or in Asia goes down uh, it's always connected to the US so I think you can choose different products. I normally would always recommend to go with the most liquid uh, products where we have a high volume. And for the index itself, yeah, you would say maybe you can't trade this, um, but the easiest way there are futures on the index itself, um, or you can trade options. Um, options is a very easy model because you don't have to invest so much premium. And I recommend to buy, for example, call options um, out of the money really far out of the money that you make sure it's only for a worst case scenario. Of course, you have to calculate in advance how much of your portfolio you want to um, um, hedge or you want to protect because at the end it's like with an insurance. Uh, you have to pay money for this and uh, you have to decide how much money you want to get out of um, your insurance if there's really a big up move. So um, this is something what you need to calculate in advance and uh, this is something what we have with options you can easily um, define. If you have no idea about option trading, we also have here some videos for option trading, what you can check to get started or to know how to do this. And um, for another product, what you can do similar things or what you can trade even without options, is at the end ETF on uh, volatility. Uh, the index we saw now, there is a similar uh, product um, as an ETF. The ETF uh, with the symbol VXX. Um, it also went up to 80. Now at the moment it's only at 30. The reason for this, um, comparing to the index, is this this ETF is also having like. Um, some inner value what goes down when nothing happens because otherwise it will be an easy product to make profit because everyone knows that um, after a few months or years the market is always going down and the volatility is increasing so normally you should just have, um, buy and hold these positions as long as it's cheap and as soon as it goes up you can um, sell this but uh, in this case it's not so easy because this product normally if nothing happens goes um, <coughs> to zero um, or like it's uh, losing um, its value. So also here um, you can trade it direct as an ETF or you can trade options on it. Uh, what's the same principle um, as we discussed it on the index itself. And um, I think an easy um, protection um, yeah, idea or strategy is to buy uh, put options on the positions which you're holding. For example, if you have, um, um, let's go to Coca-Cola. We have the stock of Coca-Cola here. It went also down from 51 to 48. And just for a worst case scenario that will, uh, Coca-Cola will maybe lose another 25% of its value, you can buy a put option on this. 
Um, it also costs money, but it's the same what I said earlier on the call. You should do this, of course, a little bit out of the money that the premium is not so high, that your insurance premium will not cost so much because um, um, it is also um, related, of course, at the end to your performance. So these are the easy, um, yeah, basic topics how to protect your portfolio. If you want to see more about these uh, details or other strategies, uh, please subscribe to our channel because, um, like I said in the beginning, this will uh, be a topic for the um, yeah for always for every time. Um, but I think in the next week it, uh, weeks it will be um, especially very important here. Thank you very much.